Six, it's a Vietnam War battle that many people you might not know about. The Battle of Sui Tree. 51 years ago today, dozens of brave Americans lost their lives. Well, today, Fort Carson hosting a memorial to pay tribute to them and the survivors. News 5's Katie Blaze in studio. A pretty big day for the regiments involved here, Katie. Yeah, Rob, that's right. The 12th Infantry Regiment and 77th Field Artillery Regiment, both part of the 2nd Battalion, are two of the three units that were at the Battle of Suey Tree. Those units still at Fort Carson, and today an opportunity for past and present soldiers to connect on this pivotal moment in history. It was a great healing for us after 50 years. March 21st, 1967, a day Paige Lenier will never forget. At the Battle of Suetre in particular, our soldiers were standing up in withering fire, firing those cannons, and they fired 42 rounds of beehive that morning. That's what saved us from having more casualties than we did. It's a very desperate fight. I'm extremely impressed by it um, and proud to be a part of it, proud of this part of our regimental history, um, and, and I hope more people you know, understand and appreciate this battle. I mean, it was one day, but it was a, it was a very, uh, very brutal and uh, intense one day of combat. As Cherry says, an important day to memorialize. It's a, it's a pretty significant event for these guys, and uh, I wanted to make it special for them. By ringing a bell for each of the 51 men who made the ultimate sacrifice. And dedicating a cannon for all who fought. It's really nice. That, uh, that's actually an artillery piece that was in Vietnam. It was returned to the U.S. in 1970. It's exactly the same cannon that we used. We're going to paint Sui Tre on it, and uh, it's going to stand as a, as a memorial with our headquarters you know, from now on. Connecting the past to the present. It's always informative for soldiers to understand kind of where they come from. Uh, I think it gives them pride, if nothing, if nothing else. And as Cherry says, something to live up to. And I'm told eight survivors from the Battle of Sui Tre attended today's event. Always watching out for you, Fort Carson, Katie Blaze, News 5. Great tribute, Katie. Thanks.